welcome back to Pandora. Welcome back to my story, Dear Mona, episode, this will be chapter three. Sean just might be the bad boy. You need to get over Mark. Let's see where her story ends today. Stupid ads. Chapter 3, The Bad Boy. I was so nervous to leave with Sean that day. He was older and just seemed so cool. He bought something out in me that I wasn't used to, but I liked it. Are you okay? You haven't said a word since we got off the bike. I, 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 that was amazing. Who knew riding a motorcycle would be that much, that fun? I told you, there is nothing to be scared of. I never let anything happen to you. I can't wait for another ride. I'll take you for a ride anytime, pretty eyes. I think Sean is flirting with me. Be shy or be flirtatious. I'd be shy. Oh my god. Why does it feel so good to get a compliment from him? I think my cheeks are turning red. Thank you. Let me just change into my work stuff. I have to fix up a bike. No problem. Go ahead. I might even help you with that. Fixing the bike, I mean. Although I wouldn't mind helping him out of his clothes. Oh, Lord. Hope you don't mind. It gets really messy here. Wow. I, I don't mind. I don't mind at all. There you are, handsome. I've been waiting all day for you to show up. Carla? What are you doing here? It's a surprise, silly. I thought you could get on the back of my, your bike again and... Um, now is not a good time. I'm, uh, here with someone. Her? You can't be serious. She looks like a little girl. Defend yourself. I might be just a girl. But at least I have class. What the hell is that supposed to mean? It means take the hint. Just because Sean turned you down doesn't mean you need to lash out at me. How dare you talk to me that way? Sean, are you going to let her talk to me like that? I'm not in charge here. She can say or do whatever she wants. And I'm sorry, but I thought I was clear when I ended things a few weeks ago. Yes, but I thought... You should leave. I'll walk you to the door. Whatever. Don't bother. I can not I can see myself out. You're lost, buddy. I'm sorry. Don't apologize. You didn't do anything wrong. I just really wish this never happened. Now, you probably think I have girls showing up at all hours of the night. Well, do you? Not anymore. And I hope you can trust me when I tell you that's the truth. He seems so sh sin But can I really trust him? 
I'll take your word for it. Thank you. So, where were we? So, uh, what did you want to show me? I'm working on a 1981 Honda CB. It's a classic. This one here, what do you think? Wow. I'm not an expert on bikes, but that looks cool. It sure is. It's quite a beauty. So, you've told me. Just like you, pretty eyes. Oh my. So I see you like your vintage bikes. I do. It's kind of a passion of mine. Interesting. In fact, could you please hand me that wrench over there? I just need a few moments to fix this up. I know where the wrench is. Right there. Handy girl. I got a sticker. Thanks. You know your way around a workshop, I see. Of course I do. I think it's important to understand the basics at the very least. Agreed. If only more people shared your opinion. I should ask him about his shop or his other passions. I'd ask him about his other passions. What else do you are you passionate about? Well, now, that's a personal question. I'm just making conversation, I guess. I'm passionate about having a good life. I don't want to spend a moment doing anything. Something I don't want to do. Oh? For instance, well, you know I dropped out of high school, right? You did what? I mean, you did? Wasn't for me. I lasted about two months until my senior year and then I left. I needed money to open up this shop. And to get that money, I needed to find work. School wasn't doing much for me. Wow, you're brave. I don't think I ever even skipped a class. Well, you're a good girl. That's what I like about you. Thank you. Now, give me a chance to impress you. Let me show you some of my other bikes. So, how was it hanging out with Sean? I'm totally jealous. <laughs> LOL. It was pretty great. A lot of fun, actually. He's an interesting guy. He really knows how to grab life by the horns, you know. I guess. Are you going to see him again? He asked me out on a date this Saturday. <gasps> OMG. Wait until Max hears about this. He's going to flip. Haha. <laughs> so you think I should go? Yes. This time you had a little fun. But don't have too much fun. As you know, he doesn't have the best reputation. Mm, I'll be careful. I know. I'll keep that in mind. Trust me. Good. Because the last thing I want to do is see you hurt again. Yeah. I don't think I'd survive it a second time. I know. I guess we'll see. That's Saturday. Hmm, what should I wear? I have an idea what to expect on this date. I have no idea. Well, I have no coins, so I have to go basic. You're going out again? That's the third time this week. I know. But this time it's on a real date. Oh, Pandora, that's wonderful. Wait, are you wearing that on your date? Is he taking you bowling? Mom. 
What? You're better off wearing a bathrobe. Well, oh, thanks. At least you will suit you. It would suit you. I'm sure my date won't care. Can you bring him in so that I can meet him? No. Not this time. Sorry, Mom. I'm still sort of feeling the situation out. I understand. Just be careful. I'm so happy to see you happy again. But I don't want that what happened to Mark happening happen again. Mom doesn't want to see me hurt again. Change the subject. Sean is nothing like Mark. Anyway, I'm excited to give this whole thing a chance. If you are excited, then I am too. Just make sure he brings you home by midnight. And no funny business. Ugh, Mom. Don't ever say that again, please. Deal. Have fun. Bye, Mom. See you later. Wow. I've never been to a place like this before. To be honest, I haven't either. I just figured this was something a girl like you would want. Even if she is a little underdressed. Oh no, I'm so sorry. It's okay. You know better next time. <laughs> I actually can't pronounce half the things on the menu. Me neither. But I think we're both safe with the chicken... Parmesan. Sounds good to me. So, do you like going to the movies? Occasionally. Cool. Maybe we should go so together sometime. I don't see why not. Hey, have you seen the movie about the cowboy who ended up landing on Mars? One hour later. We are, we really do have a lot in common, despite being so different. Favorite vi foods, music, movies? Does it bother you that you and I are different? Mm, no. No way. <laughs> You're like a breath of fresh air, to be honest. If we were the same, it'd be boring. I know. That's what makes this so much fun. So tell me, what do you want with me? I don't see why you'd be interested in someone like me. What do you want with me? With you? Well, a lot of things, if I'm honest. I wasn't lying when I said I'd thought about you over the years. Your eyes have cropped up in my thoughts more often than I'd like to admit. Then I saw you on the news winning that track race. And then I saw you volunteering at the church. And you seem like a, such a sweet girl. So, when I saw you crying that night, I thought to myself, a girl as good as her should never cry. But why do you care? I haven't had the best record with women. I really hurt a few girls. And the worst part was, I didn't even care. But when I saw you crying, I don't know. I cared. What are you, what do you want to happen between us? Right now, I just want to spend time with you. Is that okay with you? He totally dodged that question. Whatever, Pandora, you don't want a boyfriend anyway. Yeah, that sounds great. The dinner was wonderful. Wait, what's... Here's your puppy. I bet you he's going to say, will you keep it for our diamonds? It's a puppy. What are you doing out here all alone? Oh, you're so cute. Where's your mom, little buddy? Are you lost? Poor thing. Who would just leave a poor defenseless puppy outside? And right next to a parking lot. Oh, what am I going to do with you? Drop it off at a shelter. 
that's all I can do. I wish I could keep you, but my mom would never let me have a dog. But I'm sure you'll end up safe and sound at the shelter. Hey, the car's ready. Whoa, who have you got there? I just found him all alone out here. Aw, oh, poor thing. I'm going to bring him to the shelter. He's a cute little guy. I'm sure he'll find a family soon enough. Let's go, shall we? Yeah, I'm ready to go. I mean, we are ready to go. Is Sean picking you up again today? Do you even have to ask? He's been picking her up all week. Yes, he is. I've been having a good time with him. What? What is it? I don't know. We just don't see you, you at all this week. You missed two of our weekly study sessions. And you were totally daydreaming in class this morning. It just doesn't seem like you. Well, maybe I'm a little bit distracted. But isn't that what you guys wanted? I found someone else. I put Mark behind me. Of course we're happy. We just want to make sure it's the right thing for you. Yeah, we love you, babe. You guys have nothing to worry about. Sean is a great guy, and we understand each other. Well, then I'm happy for you. Is he still having that party at his shop this weekend? Sure is. Are you guys coming? Heck yes, we're coming. Hot, older bikers? It's not like we have anything better to do. Oh. Are you ready to leave, handsome? Almost. I just have to get my jacket. Don't worry. If you get cold, I'll make sure to warm you up. You don't have to waste. You don't waste time, do you? Not when I'm having this much fun. Pandora? Someone you know? No. I guess my mind just wandered to the past. Well, I know a perfect way for you to focus on the future. I just need you to say yes to one little thing. But that will be it for this video. I don't want to speed through this too fast. I want to take our time and see what y'all think about it. But next will be a night to remember. A night at Sean's party brings you closer. How will your new romance unfold? We will check that out in the next video. If y'all like this episode, hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button. Hit that bell icon so you know when I upload. If you're not afraid, open that box. I will see you on the next video. Bye, guys.